welcome to my youtube channel in this tutorial i will show you a transparent bsdf node and what can this node do for your material the transparent shader can make your object invisible in rendering it only has one input color an rgb value of 111 pure white will make it 100 percent transparent so shift a let's search for transparent bsdf transparent like this all values in between true white and uh, pitch block will be influencing the material in terms of transparency brightness as shown here you can also uh, show this uh, color picker circle and color modulation the hue saturation Transparent shader is not physically correct, so in photorealistic renderings, it will usually be mixed into the material by a factor. One example would be a left texture. Nobody will examine every single left on a tree. And this node doesn't make any sense without the other shader nodes like a glass PSDF or glossy PSDF or other nodes. For example, so let's uh, bring bring up this uh, glass PSDF node in order to show you. When plugging a PSDF into a surface like this, it's going to be creating a glass material as shown in our example and render it in cycles like this. Because I wore it's 4 and this is around, uh, you should retype or type the index of refraction of the glass 1.4 hit enter it's gonna be making your material as glass material The roughness should be zero like this. When set the IO, IOR index of refraction of the glass, it's uh, one one point forty five as shown here. It's gonna be creating a glass as shown here. So you can play around to change the color like this. When adding, you can't uh, mix this to shader notes. Just we need to uh, mix. A mix shader as shown here, plugging it in between this notes like this and connect this uh, transparent. It's going to be creating a material transparent. And in this case, you can understand that you should add transparent BSDF, which is important just for transparency of your materials like this. And it's transparent material, even. You, you try to change the IOR like this. You just want to create transparent material and play around with a color to change the color, for example, like this. And you have created this transparent material just using transparent BSDF with other nodes because this node doesn't work alone because it need uh, it needs a lot of other nodes. As shown in our example, you can use a glossy BSDF or a glass BSDF or other nodes. And that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.